Hi guys, today we are reviewing the POCO's first smartwatch. The watch was just announced at the POCO's global event and comes with a lot of cool and useful features. This may be the best budget smartwatch for 2022. The watch comes with heart rate monitoring, blood oxygen monitoring, GPS, a very bright 1.6 inches AMOLED display and much more. We will go through all its features, however, first let's see what comes in the box. In the bright yellow box we have a manual in several different languages and two pins design magnetic charger. And here it is the Poco Watch itself, let's go through the main specs. We have 1.6 inches AMOLED display with 301 ppi, 24 hours heart rate and SpO2 monitoring, more than 100 fitness modes and 100 plus watch faces, multi-system GPS, the watch is water resistant and the battery life is about 14 days, give or take, depending on your usage. The watch comes in three color variants, blue, black and ivory. When we start the watch for the first time we have to choose a language. There are currently 8 languages available, more will be probably added with future updates. To connect the watch with your phone you will need the latest version of Mi Fitness app. The setup is quite fast, it takes about 20 seconds. Now let's see what features offer the new POCO watch. With a swipe from the top we bring the notifications and with a swipe from the bottom we bring the control center for quick access to alarm, flashlight, settings and more. With a swipe from the left or right we have access to widgets such as workout, fitness stats, weather, SpO2 and heart rate monitoring. The widgets can be further customized from the Mi Fitness app. You can choose to add more or remove some of them. By pressing the button on the right side of the watch we enter the apps menu. First on the list is the workout. We have more than 100 workout mods, we can easily add or remove some of them from the menu. Poco Watch also supports auto detect mode for many of the fitness mods, this feature works well and is quite useful. During the exercises, if your watch is connected to your phone via Bluetooth, you can also control the music from the watch itself. Next on the list we have activity and fitness stats. Poco Watch comes with two main health features, one is the heart rate monitoring and the other is the SpO2, both are pretty accurate and work well. Next on the list we have sleep monitoring, stress, breathing exercises and cycles, followed by the weather app. Continue with the music control, remote camera app, alarm, stopwatch and timer. The digital compass is next on the list. Next we have notifications and find my phone feature. Keep in mind that it works only in shorter distance as the watch and the phone has to be connected via Bluetooth. Here is how it sounds. And last, before we jump to the settings is the flashlight. There are some interesting features in the settings that are worth mentioning. Starting from the top, first is the watch faces. New watch faces can be only added from the Mi Fitness app. From the brightness settings we can choose from 5 levels of brightness as well as auto brightness. Another very welcome feature is the disconnection reminder. In the display settings we have 4 different options, starting with auto lock, we can choose between 5 and 20 seconds, always on display is also available on the POCO watch, next is cover to sleep and last is double tap to wake. There is also a raise to wake feature which can be turned on in the Mi Fitness app, I can say I am surprised to see so many features on such a budget watch, pretty impressive. For vibration we have two levels, default and strong and both are well noticeable. When it comes to the Mi Fitness app, the app has a clean interface, you can easily navigate in the menus. Xiaomi keeps improving it and in my opinion is one of the best apps for smart watches. 
From the app you can add and remove workout modes, same as with the widgets. You can change the app layout from the grid to the list. You can also turn on the race to wake feature, which is off by default. The Poco Watch comes with more than 100 watch faces, ready to use from day one. They are separated into several different categories and some of them are pretty cool. The 1.6 inch AMOLED display is very bright. This is my test under the strong sunlight in Shenzhen. The strap of the Poco Watch can be easily replaced. There is a pin that have to be pressed and the strap will come out. It's very well secured on its place. The strap is well made and looks good quality. It will definitely last a long time. Charging the watch it's easy. You just have to bring the charger closer to the watch and it will stick in its place. The magnets are quite strong. I can easily get about 10 days of use in a single charge, however, this will depend on the way of use. Always on display and the use of GPS will drain the battery faster. Overall guys, I am really impressed with the Poco watch. The AMOLED display is very bright and the watch has a lot of useful features. The interface is pretty smooth, with all these features and long battery life, probably this is the best watch in its class. That's it for today guys, if you have any questions let me know in the comments and I'll do my best to answer you. Thanks for watching and as always, don't forget to subscribe, like and comment, don't be shy, more cool gadgets from Poco are on the way, stay cool and I'll see you soon, cheers!